Find a place to sit down and let yourself have time to reflect and pray. Straighten your back and allow yourself to breathe. Sit peacefully in God's presence and his unconditional love. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the the Holy Spirit, amen. Amen. I invite the Holy Spirit to help guide my prayer. We ask for the grace to see our lives through God's eyes, not our own. I spend a few moments in gratitude, thanking God for one or two of the blessings, big or small, that I have received today. We give Looking thanks. back, I ask God to reveal God to me that moment which was Think most draining. One blessing you received today. I use my imagination family, to revisit friends, that time, teachers, feeling my emotions, remembering my thoughts. What made it draining? I speak to God about that moment. Think about your gifts. How have you used them for others today? Is there a way you can use them more or better? Looking over my day a second time, I ask God to reveal the most life-giving moment of the day. What brought forth life? I relive my emotions and remember my thoughts. I speak to God about that moment. If you acted badly today, ask for forgiveness. Ask God to show you ways to act differently in the future. Ignatius of Loyola and St. John Francis Regis, pray for us. And today, as every day, we continue to dedicate all of our thoughts, words, and actions to the greater glory of God. In the name Choose of the Father, and of the Son, the of the and day. of the Holy Spirit. What will Amen. you do for the rest of the day? Whom will you be with? Ask God for one thing that you ought to do today. Listen for God's response. St. Ignatius of Loyola and St. John Francis Regis, pray for us. And today as every day, we continue to dedicate all of our thoughts, words, and actions to the greater glory of God. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. 